Well, hello YouTube and welcome back to Retired for Life. So we have got a break in the weather that it looks like it's going to last for two days, fingers crossed, which means we're going to get up and get the sawmill running again. So walking away from the chipper, got a few other odd jobs that we've got to get to. I've got a repair that I've just got a part come in for, but we will get back to all of that when the rain starts again in two days time. All right, folks, there is our two new logs. So the one at the back, we still had uh, to deal with. It's going to go into uh, one by eight boards. So as you can see, it's not the greatest. It's not bad, but it's got some knots in it. Now these two here are beautifully clear. So that's, uh, that's what we're looking for, for uh, one by threes, or at least I hope they are. You never really can tell until you get into them to see how good they are. So this first one is a bit of a brute. So it will be fun to cut up. Let's get the sawmill set up and we'll get to work. Well, we're not as far along as I want it to be this time of year. The uh, weather has really got us as the black flies are now showing up. Oh boy, that's gonna make it a lot less entertaining. But that's part of working outside. I'm uh, used to that. So we're gonna spray up, get ready to go. So this log is approaching the capacity of the mill. Makes it very difficult to get the clamp on. So what I do with logs like this is uh, I jam wedges in underneath it. And it does hold it very firmly for what we're doing here between the weight of the log and the wedges. It's not gonna go anywhere on me. But you don't want to do too many cuts like that. All right, folks, we did really good yesterday. We've got uh, one more of these new logs here, and then I'll be back down again to one eight footer. I want to get through these two. Now there is an awful lot of sawing that takes place when you're uh, creating uh, one by threes, but we're, we're getting there. I was seriously considering not doing more one by threes, but that log is just such a nice log in such good shape. I've got about uh, a little over 200 one by threes now. They are a very key component to doing the uh, board and batten, so uh, I do need them. It is a beautiful day out here today which means it's gonna feel hot in the sun later on. But we have a few days of rain coming behind us. All right, here we go. All right, folks, that is all of our eight footers now done, put away, nice, neat, stacked and everything. And we're just starting the 10 footers. Now I'm starting with the smallest one. So what I'm targeting for out of these is two by sixes. And this one is too long. I, I'm not gonna be able to cut through. It was cut a little over 10 foot six, which means I can't get all the way through it there on the mill. So I'm gonna get the chainsaw and just whack a few inches off the end of this thing before I get started with it. There's no point in putting it up there and then not being able to cut it properly. And that's it, that's all I need. All right, let's get it up on the mill. Well, I hope you guys have been enjoying today's video. And if you have, I'd really appreciate the like. 
and I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. And don't forget, if you've got any thoughts, suggestions, anything like that, I'd love to hear from you. All right, let's get back to the job. Well, that was pretty easy to start with. I do need to slide it ahead a bit. There's a new challenge with every log. All right, there is quite a bit of dirt on this one. So we'll get that cleaned off first. And then we'll make some lumber. Folks, there is a 10 foot log number two up there for today. So all the eight footers are done. And this stuff is now pretty much all packed up and that's gonna be it. So I can close this tent and basically forget about it for a while. And we have just started stacking uh, the 10 footers in here. 
So I've got my two by sixes there and I've got a combination of uh, one by fours and one by sixes over there. So pretty much everything that I've got left, the log that's on the mill and these five, seven logs over here are going to uh, get turned into two by sixes because I need those uh, those two by sixes for joists and that kind of thing. But I think we're going to call that it for today. It has been a long, exhausting day. Whew. So there's supposed to be rain coming in. So we'll have we'll have another busy day tomorrow. We'll try to get as many logs as we can get done. So. We'll see you folks in the morning. Well, good morning, folks. Let's get back to work. We'll see what kind of damage we can do to that 10 foot log pile. All right, folks, we made really good progress today. I've got four logs left, and the four of them are pretty straight. Uh, so there shouldn't be any complications with them. They should go pretty quickly. But for now, it is almost three o'clock, and we've got a couple of days of rain coming, but I wanna do a little bit of lawn cutting before we get that far. And I'm gonna spread a little more grass seed on a couple of bare spots here. So that will use up the rest of our afternoon. But it's been good. I'm quite pleased with uh, how well we did. So if you folks have been finding the videos interesting, or at the very least, a little bit entertaining, I'd really appreciate the like and have you share it around. And I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. That would really help. So remember to be good to each other, stay safe out there, and we will see you out on the trails the next time. That's sticky.